guys, welcome to the CCC 420. My name is Chase and this is Turkey Tuesday episode 29. Uh, today I am reviewing some Imperial Extracts. Uh, finally, I'm, I've been meaning to review this company <clears throat> for a really long time. Uh, this company, Imperial Extracts, is kind of an up-and-comer. Uh, I've seen them kind of come around in the past three, four years. I'm not exactly sure how long they've been around, but definitely one of the newer companies. And I swear, everything I've tried from them has been really, really loud. Uh, they have a really keen eye for source material when it comes to trim and whole plant uh, runs that are that are a little more discounted. This is actually their higher end, uh, the gold line. So this is a nug run and it's usually a little bit expensive for a nug run. I haven't seen these usually much cheaper than $80 on the gram, which is a little high for something that's not a live resin or something fresh frozen. But uh, regardless, this is an extremely high quality nug run and uh, I've been wanting to try their, their top shelf for a while now. So really glad I did. And uh, yeah, this, this comes to me from SD Best Meds here in San Diego. Um, I don't normally see Imperial Extracts there too often, so this was kind of a random drop, but this is the Kushko OG. So um, when I saw that, that uh, they had the, uh, the Imperial Extracts and then that they had uh, Kushko, a flavor that I've never seen Imperial run before, um, I knew I had to go grab some and uh, yeah not let down by this stuff in the least. Um, I reviewed this flavor once before on the channel. Uh, it was the uh, Unregistered Extracts Kushko, um, and I would say that this stuff is a little bit fresher. It feels like the, um, I guess that the terpene profile on it is a little bit more complete in regards to what I expect from a Kushko concentrate. I mean, I've puffed on the, the authentic Kushko flowers and, uh, and I've had the, excuse me, I've had the concentrates in a variety of forms, so from different companies etc so i think at this point i have a pretty good idea of what uh what kushko should taste like and uh yeah this is definitely what kushko should taste like so i'm gonna go in on the first dab here guys of the uh, imperial extracts kushko og gold line nug run brought to me by sd best meds here in san diego cheers guys really terpy yeah just a uh, really flavorful and uh, <clears throat> well executed OG Kush Nug Run and yeah clearly using some very high quality Kushko source material <clears throat> I think maybe uh, the unregistered I got um, that time was a little bit cheaper so it's possible that I bought like something along the lines of a whole plant <clears throat> Um, this is definitely a nug run, no doubt in my mind. Yeah, the uh, <coughs> flavors on this one are <coughs> no, uh, <coughs> no trimminess, no, no plantiness, no, yeah, none of that, no chlorophyll action, just uh, <coughs> <coughs> just OG Kush. Whew. Yeah, some kill. So yeah, uh, you might have noticed when the episode started. I'm wearing a CCC 420 t-shirt and uh, yeah, I finally had these made. Um, we got a lot of stuff in the works, guys. Um, we have a website coming up. It's gonna be the CCC420.net and uh, that's where these shirts are gonna be for sale here. I'm planning to launch the website on the new year, uh, hopefully to hoping to launch it on the first. Um, this is not going to be the finalized shirt necessarily. Um, I think you guys can probably see in the light here, uh, compared to the logo behind me on the TV, that this this is a little bit dim. Uh, we're trying to make it a little bit brighter, maybe like a yellow outline or something like that. 
Um, if you guys have any ideas or you know suggestions on how you'd like the logo to be uh, colored or and I mean any ideas in general feel free to leave them down in the comments below I would definitely love to read through uh, and hear some ideas most definitely <clears throat> but yeah uh, long story short guys t-shirts are definitely on the way and uh, we got a lot of stuff in the works uh, the website is gonna be basically like a portal to uh, see a lot of the videos on the show um, we're gonna have a forum it'll have like a message board um, we're gonna have a shop with all of our merchandise uh, available for sale and there's gonna be uh, sections for each uh, individual segment you know there will be a Turpy Tuesday section where you can find out more information about this show um, wake and bake Wednesday when Shane and Dan get that roll in so um, yeah, definitely looking forward to getting the website up, um, getting everything going, and hanging out with you guys on the forums. Um, I know YouTube comments can be kind of a clusterfuck sometimes, so you know, a, a nice organized message board can be a cool place to hang out. So, yeah, again, really looking forward to getting that going, guys. So, gonna go in on my second dab here of the Kushko, uh, the Kushko Nug Run from Imperial Extracts here in, in San Diego, brought to me by SD Best Meds. Yeah. Um, this is the first time trying the Imperial Extracts Gold Line stuff, and I gotta say, after trying this Kushko, all I want to do is try more flavors. Um, I saw that they had some stuff from DNA Genetics, I think some strawberry banana kind of stuff. I want to say I saw strawberry banana cookies. Uh, I think I saw that over at Left Coast. <clears throat> yeah, uh, Imperial is running some killer flavors. Second dab here, guys. Cheers. I think I mentioned this in a previous OG review, but I think of OG Kush as kind of like the, the IPA of, of flavors, of cannabis flavors. <clears throat> it's really piney. It's got kind of a soapy edge to it. <coughs> you know, certain cuts of OG can be kind of sweet. <coughs> it's like some IPAs can be kind of sweet. <coughs> Oof. Yeah. <coughs> But I don't puff on OGs just for the flavor. I am all about the OG effect, <clears throat> which is really, um, it's definitely that ton of bricks. I mean, <clears throat> um, this is one that's just gonna feel it all over your entire body. <clears throat> I mean, the uh, the onset of it, the, the OG Kush is definitely a a cerebral buzz as much as it is a, uh, a body fry. I think it's a uh, <clears throat> Ochi Kush is largely misinterpreted as a uh, as an indica when really it is a, a very much a hybrid. I mean it's an indica dominant hybrid but <clears throat> um, yeah I mean <coughs> I am thoroughly faded. <coughs> <coughs> yeah the Kushko is uh, I mean at this point in the game, I would say, if someone had to ask me what is, you know, what what's a flavor that <clears throat> personifies OG Kush, or, you know, this just a definitive OG Kush cut. At this point in time, you know, if you were to offer some OG Kush to somebody or whatever, <clears throat> I would I would have to say the Kushko is probably my choice. Kushko has grown it to perfection. I think it's safe to say they have grown. And, uh, and exported many, many a pound of this uh, this OG Kush from their uh, from their grow operation. And <clears throat> oh man, it's uh, this is definitely a result of years of R and D. <laughs> and yeah, this Kushko OG Nug Run from Imperial Extracts is uh, a really good Nug Run uh, concentrate of it.
All right, guys, thank you for tuning into the CCC 420. Uh, this has been Turpy Tuesday, episode 29, reviewing the Imperial Extracts Gold Line Kushko Nug Run Shatter, brought to me by SD Best Meds here in San Diego. And yeah, this uh, this Kushko OG is an absolute kill. Uh, if you want some serious OG gas in your life, get your hands on some of this stuff. And uh, yeah, that's going to wrap up this review, guys. Uh, thank you for tuning into the CCC 420. I will talk to you next week. Peace.